stars welcome back to the channel this is me applying my smashbox primer which i love and it's for blemish control and it stays on all night i love it here i am filling in my eyebrows i'm using a lighter shade of brown and i'm taking my time and i'm gradually building because i like my eyebrows to look natural and uh i take nice short strokes and for me that's having my eyebrows on fleek okay <laughs> so that's what i am doing and i'm just using a regular angle brush here i'm just putting on a little um eyeshadow primer so my eyeshadow can stay on for the entire night while i'm out on my date because that's the worst thing to have your makeup fade while you're on a date it's like okay this is the first date i am not ready for you to see me without any makeup yet <laughs> so i'm just making sure that's like um really evened out before I apply my eyeshadow. I'm using my Sugar Pill palette, which is my favorite palette and I've had forever. I just love the shades in um, the Sugar Pill palette, this Sugar Pill palette, and they're so pigmented and I never have to wor worry about my eyeshadow fading. And I'm just applying that in the uh, inner crease. That color right there, guys, is my favorite color. All the products will be listed below. That color is um, Flame Point. Oh, I love it. Here I'm using an uh, eyeshadow by Urban Decay. It's like a purple plum color. Products will be listed below. And I'm putting that all over my lid. And what's pretty about that color, it has like a little sparkle going on with it. So it's like, ooh, ooh la la, yes. Without trying too hard. But as you will see later, I'm still going to add some glitter going on because I was in a, a really glamorous mood where I wanted to be subtle yet glamorous, if that makes any sense. <laughs> and now here I am. I'm just blending everything together so you can't see where anything starts or where anything ends. So I'm blending it until it's flawless. Yes blend 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 by the way i am not a professional makeup artist i just play one on youtube <laughs> so i'm just making sure i got it blended out nicely here i am using eyelash glue and um, i'm going to add a strip of glitter on my eye so i'm applying the glue close to my eyelashes and i'm just applying it in a straight line so when I go to add my glitter all I have to do is put the glitter on top and I'm just using another angled brush which something about angled brushes I love they just work for me and um, and I could do so so much with the, the angled brushes yeah so I just apply the glue on both eyes of course in a straight line that's just pure glue on that brush and by the way, when you're using glitter, at least for me, it can get really, really messy. So I got to take my time. Even though I take my time, it still gets messy. Just applying some more glue because I want to make sure, I like to make sure I have a nice amount of glue because I really want my glitter to last all night and I really want it to stick to um, my eyes. So here I am. <gasps> You know what that glitter when i opened it up it almost went all over the place because my niece gave me some of her glitter and that's what i'm using and i just put it in that container and i kind of put too much in it so when i opened it up it almost splattered everywhere so that's why i made that face <laughs> so here i am using the same brush that i have the glue that i use to apply the glue and i'm putting that on top of the glue as you can see like in a straight line i'm sure you guys if you watch makeup tutorials or makeup videos I'm sure you've seen people do this that's actually how I learned how to do it and it's a great great technique and actually the the lash glue doesn't irritate your eyes and I have very sensitive eyes so I'm just really packing that on but I'm packing it on in a straight line here I am using a liquid eyeliner which I never line like the inner corner of my eyes. And that's what I'm doing now. I don't know, I was just in that mood. I just gave myself a nice little line. Yeah, with liquid liner. 
I guess I really wanted to make my eyes pop. Here I am, sipping on a little something something. You guys don't need to know what it is. Let's just say it, it makes me feel good. <laughs> okay, as you can tell, well, you can't see it through the camera, but the glitter was everywhere. And that's just the nature of working with glitter. And I tried to use my brush to get it off, but that stuff was not coming off. And I was like, look, I ain't got time for this. I just grabbed my washcloth and um, I started wiping it off. And of course it all came off. And it came off a lot quicker because I don't have time to be sitting here taking off no glitter one by one nobody got time for that here i am applying the same lash glue on my lashes you guys i've gotten so much better putting my eyelashes on yes and i i actually use my fingers too and i'm i'm so good at it now so putting my lashes on i don't remember what lashes those are i will list them below though yeah see wow isn't it amazing how like lashes can make a big difference to your look here I am, I'm putting more glue in my inner corner of my eyes because I decided that I wanted to put some glitter in the inner corner of my eye. Yeah, I put the glue there. I know that's dangerous, right? But I'm damn near blind now and anyway, so I was like, I ain't got nothing to lose. So I'll put some glue there. At least I'll look cute, right? <laughs> what did I drop here? I don't even remember. Oh, the glitter again. I told you that glitter was so messy, but it's, it's so worth it because it's so pretty and i forget where she got that glitter from i don't even know the name of the glitter i saw it in her makeup kit and i said oh my god can i have this she says no you can't have this she says but i'll give you some i was like okay <laughs> and my niece is like 14 so she gave me some so that's why i do not remember the the name of the brand or the uh, color but i will find out so i just put that glitter on top of the glue in the inner corner of my eye see look you see the difference <laughs> I got so excited. This, I was like, oh my god, I'm so excited. Yes, this is the look I had in my head. It is manifesting. This is my um, concealer palette, which I've had, guys, for ages. Okay, it's by Coastal Scents, so you can imagine how long I've had it. But this is the best, best concealer that I've, I've found. And I've used MAC and paid all that money, but I love this. Here I am contouring my cheekbones trying to make my cheekbones you know snatched yeah so that's why i'm going heavy in on the contour i love snatched cheekbones and i notice that when i contour them heavy it just like brings them out it just like really shapes my face i'm like yes yes <laughs> so i'm just blending that out so I don't look like uh, I have railroad tracks in my cheeks. Oh, guys, and that um, highlighter, that's a drugstore brand highlighter. It's called number seven, and it is awesome. The color is called Caramel, and it's by a company by the name of Shimmer Palette. I got it from CVS. It's great. It really, like, makes you glow. Like, you would never believe that it's a drugstore highlighter. See? Isn't that pretty? I don't know if it's hard for you guys to see because of the light up. Okay, you can see it right there. Look, see? Look at that. Yes. And I did not pay over $10 for that. I think I paid like seven. And here again, I am contouring. I'm working on snatching the hell out of that nose. <laughs> yes. And that's another... Uh, technique that takes me forever to do that I have not mastered I got to take time with that if not I will look like the stripes that a skunk has on it so I take my time and I blend that in to give myself a nice little point to my nose yes and I use my fingers for me I mean I have all kinds of brushes but I find that my fingers are the best it's the best brush here I am using that blush by Revlon I'm sorry not by Revlon it's by Wet n Wild and it was like really cheap another drugstore product just to put on the apples of my cheeks to give me that rosy kind of effect so I look like I'm blushing 24 7 and my good old banana powder yes oh guys by the way I didn't tell you I found my banana palette my banana powder remember I had told you I lost it when I moved from California to New York but I found it, it was at my mom so I got that I'm using that yes and I love it because it gives me that gives me that polished look that's my MAC highlighter right there 
and I'm putting that on top of my um, my shimmer palette highlighter to bring really bring out that highlight you see how it, and it blends in so nicely together so since I call myself really bringing out my eyes accenting my eyes I wanted to keep the lips a little subtle so I'm just using like that same highlighter and I'm putting it on my lips yeah it, the idea just came to me I was like let me put this highlight on my lips and see what that looks like and it came out nice and I'm just applying some lip gloss on top of that so that's what you see me doing here it's nice and subtle right I love that you guys like that I was like so feeling that yes I'm like mm-hmm yes and it really made my eyes stand out. You couldn't tell me nothing that night. <laughs> and it's nice and soft looking. And of course, I got to set my makeup with Fix Plus. Yes. And you know what? That night, I was feeling myself a little bit too much because I drenched my face in it. That's why you see me like fanning myself. I put too much. It looked like I had like dived in a pool or something. But it all worked out. There it is. That's the final look. And I was happy and pleased with it. See my little glitter going on in my eye? Yes. Mm -hmm. Yep. Can't tell me nothing. At least that night you couldn't tell me anything. And then I got inspiration because I just... Oh, by the way, that dress is a free people's dress, guys. If you're interested, I love their clothing. But that night I decided to change my clothes. And I put on some, some jeans and this grungy shirt, which I love. So I decided to go with this dark, bold lipstick. And that's, that's what I'm wearing right there. I think it's by Ruby Kisses. I got it from the beauty supply store. Yeah, and that was my evening. That was my look, my bold lips and my eyes, my jeans and my grunge shirt. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, okay? And I'll see you in the next video.